What's going on guys? I am excited to come to you today with a new tool review. Guys, this is the Sigmund Laser Level CM-701. I put a link to this down in the description. You can buy them off of Amazon. These things sell at a fraction of what the high-end big name brand laser level sell for and it really blows me away i have played with this thing a little bit and i am amazed at how good this thing functions for what it is uh, it just it blew me away it comes in a nice case here uh, you can carry it protect it foam padding in here uh, right off the bat we're going to pull the charging cable out this is a usb-c charging cable so you can charge this using a phone charger in your car or whatever the case may be. We've got a green card here that's gonna assist with being able to see that laser line and get everything set up. Uh, let's see, user manual. This is gonna explain how the functions and features work. We've got a remote. This is pretty neat. I haven't seen that on a laser before. Now we've got a tripod stand here looks to be quarter 20 on the top and 5 8 thread on the bottom so if you have a grade tripod uh, this is going to screw onto it and allow you to adapt over and mount this unit onto it we also have an l bracket here uh, has magnets in the back of it so i believe you could attach that to a metal pole uh, be it inside a structure outside and be able to utilize this now we're going to get into the meat and potatoes of this game and we're going to pull this little thing out this is the Sigmund laser level right here. I'm going to go ahead and mount it on this little tripod stand here. Now, the one thing that I have noticed in using this, and this is full disclosure, they sent this to me for review, but you have this adjustment here, which I like. I like being able to fine tune that vertical line, be it this way or this way, um, but I don't, it doesn't seem to lock. Uh, so it, it's really easy to bump it and it get knocked offline. I would like to see a way to where once you set this to a specific location, you could lock it down. Now, first things first, we're going to flip this thing on. And right off the bat, something that the cheaper laser levels do not do that this one does, self-leveling. Boom, it is set. Everything is level. I'm looking around the room. I've got a nice level laser beam right through my beard, I believe. Um, luckily, it's not a burning laser. It would cut all my beard off, and I wouldn't be happy. But everything is set and ready to go. We've got a remote here. Uh, first thing we can do is we can do V1, and that's going to turn off our vertical 1. Now we can hit V2. That's going to turn off our vertical 2 and just leave our horizontal. We can now turn off the horizontal, but when we mash the H button, it turns back on the two verticals. Now we can turn that off. You're going to have to have one or the other on at all times. Now, if you want to conserve battery or you need less light, you can simply use the dimmer button here to dim that down. Then you can bring it back to full brightness. Now, something that I'm going to bring up here. Sigmund doesn't offer, as of right now, shooting this video, they don't offer a receiver. But since this is a green laser, you should be able to purchase just about any green laser receiver and actually utilize it with this. And then what you could do is use a tripod. You could use a cheap $10 tripod off Amazon if you wanted to. Get you a grade rod and a receiver set this thing up and you have a full laser grade system ready to go and you can utilize it anywhere anytime since it is rechargeable you can charge it in the car charger then you have this card here and you can see on it just how bright that line illuminates on this card this makes it easier especially if you're out a good distance away and you're trying to find that line you know especially out in the brighter sunlight, this makes it easier to find for you. I have used these on numerous jobs. Um, I have a different version that I've got, and I'm telling you, the versatility of this 360 degree laser is just mind blowing what it can do for you as far as grading is concerned, construction projects, hanging pictures on a wall, um, 
anything where you need to set a vertical line or a horizontal level, you can do with this. Um, let's say, for instance, you had an a uneven spot in the floor or something to that extent. Well, you can come through with a tape measure and you can measure from the floor up and say, okay, well, I'm X inches here. And then you could come all the way over to the other side of the room and measure again and see if there's a slope in the floor. Uh, you could do the same thing on foundation. However you would want to utilize it, it's going to work from that aspect. I've used the laser to set up and mark all of my holes when running rough in electrical. Everything is perfectly lined up, boom, boom, boom. Set it up, raise it up to where my light switches are, set the height, and go around and mount every one of my boxes. I don't have to pull tape measure out, do anything. I can just hammer them right into the stud. Same thing with the receptacles, drop down to that level, set every one of them. And when you look around the room, they're all identical. So guys, as far as the laser level is concerned, I cannot emphasize how useful these tools are. And Sigmund has really stepped up the game as far as laser levels are concerned with giving you the auto level feature the ability to have 360 degree leveling and the fact that it's in a package here that's affordable. Um, you know, when you talk about a laser level system, you talk $500, $700 to buy one of these and you can set this unit up right here right now for less than 150 bucks. It's a game changer, guys. It really is. If you're looking for a laser level, I can definitely recommend the Sigma. You can set it up, use it however you want to use it. Use it with a receiver, without a receiver, with a grade rod, with a tape measure, whatever you want to do. Guys, I highly recommend it. I appreciate y'all tuning in. Stick with us. We're going to be coming to you with more videos as far as tool reviews and how-tos and things of that nature. So don't forget to subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Drop comments or questions down below. And as always, stick with us. We'll be coming to you with more.